everyone, I'm Teresa with NVIDIA and I've got a trend alert for you today. This is the My Three Lives trend. It's a lot of fun. You get to show off three different sides of your personality or three different hobbies. So it's a great way for your audience to get to know you. In today's video, I'm gonna show you the exact step-by-step -step process you can follow to recreate this trend. It's gonna be super easy because we're gonna use a ready-to-use template from NVIDIA. And the best part is if you stick around to the end of the video, I'm gonna show you some ideas for how you can take this trend and use it to promote your business. Sounds good, let's jump in. The first thing you wanna do is figure out what your three lives are. So these can be your job, your hobbies, or just whatever you spend a lot of your time doing. So if you're a parent, that can be one of them. Or if you spend a ton of time binging Netflix, that can be one of them. There are no rules here. A lot of creators have put a really funny twist on this trend by saying things like, one of their three lives is tired person. So once you've got your three lives picked out, you're gonna go through your camera roll and see what video clips you have that can represent each one of your three lives. You'll need eight clips for the first one and then seven for the next two, and they're gonna be super short clips. And then you'll also need a clip for the intro, which is gonna be about three seconds, and that can just be any clip of you, maybe your favorite video you have of yourself on your camera roll. And if you don't think you have enough video clips, you can go ahead and throw a few photos into the mix too, because they're so short, it won't even be all that noticeable. So if you wanna throw some photos in there, go ahead and do that. All right, so once you've got everything gathered, head over to the link in the description. That's gonna take you straight to the template. Go ahead and hit use this template. That's gonna open up the in-video editor. Once you get into the editor, you can see that the music is already in place and the scenes are already synced up to the music. So all you have to do is plug in your own media and change the text to make this template your own. So let's go ahead and upload our media. I'm gonna create a new folder for this project. Just a pro tip, it's always a good idea to keep your footage organized. It will make your life a lot easier in the long run. All right, now let's start editing the video. First, take the clip that you picked out for the intro and drag it on top of the video that's currently in place. This menu will come up, go ahead and hit replace, and there you go. Up next, we come to the text slide. So go ahead and change that to whatever you want your first life to be. And this trend usually has just a black slide with really simple text on it, but you don't have to stick to that exactly. If you wanted to change the color of the canvas or the font, you could go ahead and do that. Click the background, then click canvas color, and then go ahead and select the color you want. And if you wanna change the font, click on the text then select font and find a new font that you like. All right, now for the next segment, this is where you're gonna have your really short clips that change really frequently. If you click timeline, that opens up the advanced editor and you can see all the different clips and how they're laid out so that they play one after the other. So go ahead and put your cursor over the first one and drag your clip on and hit replace just like we did before. Continue that for the rest of the segment and then continue that for the next two segments. And there you go, that's a quick look at how you can take this trend and make it your own. As you can see, it's super easy. Now let's go ahead and go over some really cool ideas for how you can take this and use it to promote your business. As you probably already know, Instagram Reels can be a super powerful tool if you're trying to get more exposure and reach a broader audience. And hopping on trends can work wonders. So the first idea is to simply use this trend to show off three products. So this could be maybe your three newest products or your three most popular products. It's super easy to do, like in this example for a coffee brand. Just take a few photos or video clips of your products and plug them into the template. Next, you can show it your customers in three different settings. So basically you're taking this trend and creating it from your customer's point of view, like in this example for a shoe company. Your customers might wear these boots hiking, walking around the city, and working on a farm. So basically this is just an excuse to show off some really cool video clips of your products. And the last idea is a lot more specific, but if you have a photography business, a lot of photographers have been taking this trend and making it about their three photography lives. So basically the three types of photography that they specialize in. For example, wedding photos, senior portraits, and event photography. And there you have it. If you found this video useful, be sure to subscribe to this channel because we post new trend videos like this all the time and you don't wanna miss them. And for more inspiration, you can check out this video on the top TikTok trends that every business should use. I'm Teresa with NVIDIA and I'll see you in the next one.